guess I'll open here then. <laughs> oh, would you look at that? Well, how's it people? You know, I honestly can't believe I haven't done this video yet. I think it's time. So that we're gonna taste South Korean snacks. This is why everyone at BuzzFeed is losing their jobs because I'm, 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 I'm taking your jobs. And now you're probably thinking, well, Sam, you've been living in Korea for a very long time. Surely by now you've tasted all their snacks. No, there are still many Korean snacks that I haven't yet tried simply because, quite frankly, you know, I, I, I was too scared. I won't lie. Because some Korean snacks, some of these flavors, they're, they're a little too out there for me. You guys have taken snacks to a whole new level. Even though most Korean snacks are quite nice, there are still some of those Korean snacks that are just very different. Just, you know, my, my, my South African tongue is still like, mm-mm. And so I just never tried them because they were just too different. So anyway, I went out and I got a whole bunch of Korean snacks, snacks that I haven't yet tried. And obviously I'm not gonna try the normal, the ones that taste good because then there would be no video. It might look like I, I'm not scared right now, but actually I'm pooping in my pants. Cause you know, so I, I, I love you, I love you Korea, but some of your snacks, well, they're there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Also, I, I should mention that it's, it's nine in the morning. A snack challenge at nine in the morning is not the greatest idea. Anyway, so let's start with the chips first. So I, I got these chips. Firstly, can we just take a moment for Korean packaging? Look at this guy. Look at the little face, huh? Oh, what a little banana. I don't even know what you are. Like a rabbit cross a banana cross a chip hugging a straw. I don't know what's going on there. Nonetheless, you are cute, buddy. Can I take you home? Oh, wait, I did take you home. Okay. This is a banana chip. And I'm not talking about like an actual banana chip. No, I'm talking about a banana flavored chip with a strawberry coating just just why you know ju just why when i eat chips i don't want them to be banana flavored and then as if that's not enough you're giving it a strawberry coating what they even have a story to go with this look at this little banana guy he's feeling cold or something and then I don't know what happens, but he's falling into a pit of something. Turns out he's falling into a pit of strawberries and then things happen and he turns into a strawberry banana. Great story. All right, let's go. Oh, wow. Just smell that. Smell that. Yeah, that's definitely strawberry. I don't know if you can see this. Let me do the, the beauty vlogger thing. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I don't know, hey? When you first put it in your mouth, you're like, mmm, okay, strawberry, nice! Then the banana hits you and then you're like, mm, no, okay! And then your brain is telling you this is a chip. And then you're like, mm-mm, mm-mm, mm-mm. And then we've got corn to. Also, can I just say, buddy, you're a chip and you're saying, I want more. That would make you a cannibal chip. Okay, you should stop that behavior. If you're from South Africa and you know about flings, yeah, they look just like flings. Hey, look at that. Hey, it looks like a fling. And then you turn it around and you're like, oh, wait. Oh, wait. Ho, oh, oh, ho, oh. ho. This chip is dipped in hazelnut chocolate. So let's go. Oh. 
Oh my word! I, I don't know! Oh my god! I totally love this! It's so good! Mm-mm-mm! That sounded like Yoda. Yeah, I want more. I do want more. And I'm gonna have more. Mm -hmm. Okay, now, next we have a, a, a chip that I'm not so excited about. I mean, Ojingo, which means oh, just my favorite thing. Cuttlefish. I don't know if I ever told you this, but I absolutely hate I hate anything from the sea. Everything that is under the sea, it is under the sea for a reason. Can we just leave everything that is under the sea, under the sea, please? So basically, this is a peanut and then it's got a cuttlefish coating. I mean... Oh, excuse me. Oh, you know what I've gathered from this? So the peanut has been coated by squid flavored coating 28 times really really i mean is one time not enough i mean zero times would be the best but like is one time not enough you want to do it 28 times who was that person who was like i know what's a great idea for a snack let's take a bloody peanut and then coat it in bloody squid coating i'm gonna give this a go <laughs> Just give me a second. Yeah, because that smell, it smells like it's going to remain on my fingers into my next lifetime even, so. Oh, no. <coughs> I can't, I can't, I can't do this. Okay, okay, okay. No, I can't. Do it for the video, they say. It'll be fun, they say. Oh uh, no 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 no! I'll have the peanut. There's the peanut. I'll have the peanut. Oh, the peanut's great. Next. Okay, let's get the sea things out the way. Seaweed crisps. <laughs> oh, but these are not just any seaweed. These are honey corn flavored seaweed crisps look at that delicious piece of seaweed i'm 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 i'm, I'm so excited okay here goes okay 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 <laughs> you know what i just want to say that that made me gag purely because I, I hate seafood. So if you love seaweed, this probably would be amazing to you. But I just, I can't. Let's move on to some sweets. Would anyone like some bamboo salt candy? Oh boy. I can't wait to taste what bamboo salt candy tastes like. I don't know what I'm tasting. I mean, I've never tasted bamboo, but I, is this what bamboo tastes like? It's very salty. I mean, it's not called bamboo salt candy for nothing. We, I get the salt. I have no idea what I'm tasting. It tastes like, it just tastes like a salty sweet. This should just be called salt candy. Mm, yeah, hey? I found something very interesting. I understand that there are many different kinds of cheese in the world, but Strawberry flavored cheese, really? Oh, it's, oh, I don't like the way it flops over. Oh, wow, that is wrong. It tastes like strawberry yogurt that's congealed. I think even the seaweed crisps are better than this. Woo, I have so many words for that. I'm not gonna say any of those words. Let me just get my gloves again. I love how it says here, oh my God. Yeah, that's exactly right. That's exactly how I feel about the snack. Just, oh my God. 
<laughs> I don't think I can do this. This is like biltong, but the just the worst kind. Oh hell no. Oh hell no. What even is this? Oh my god! <laughs> it's alive! Dried squid. <laughs> It sounds delicious, doesn't it? It's the entire squid. It actually looks like baby alien. I'm just gonna try a little bit, okay? <coughs> no, for just forget it. Just forget it. No! What are you staring at? Like you would have the guts to try dried squid, Harry the Hedgehog. Yeah, you try it, Harry the Hedgehog. You try it, go on. Oh! How did this get in the trolley? know who put this in the trolley I definitely didn't put this in the trolley because this was meant to be a video on snacks I've never tried and you know I may have tried this once or twice or 587 times but it's just so good Korea I love you for inventing this. <laughs> a few years ago Korea brought this to life. They're called honey butter chips. This is God's gift to earth. Honestly, I would I would sacrifice my right uh, no, okay no. I, I I need my right arm. Um I would give up my younger sister for this. I would I would do many crazy things for this. Oh, can you smell that? Just go on, smell it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. On that happy note, I'm gonna end it there. That was me testing some South Korean snacks that I've never tasted before. Well, you know, most of them. I will say, Korea, you guys take snacks to a whole new level, hey? And I'm just glad that I finally tasted them after living here for so long. As always, if you like the video, give it a like. If you are Korean or you are in Korea and you know of a Korean snack that is a little bit different to conventional snacks and you want me to try it, tell me in the comments below. Don't forget to follow me on all the social medias and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and of course press the bell, that bloody bell button. And uh, I will see you next week for a new video. Goodbye.